me, Mrs. T, and today I'm here with a what's in my bag combination, how I organize my bag type video. So, here is my bag that I have been using faithfully since May when I received it for Mother's Day. It is Michael Kors, you guys know, that is my fave of all fave bags. And um, I'm going to show you guys what's in it, and then I'm going to also show you how I organize it. So, this is like my summer edition bag, I guess. First things first is my wallet, which is also my Kors. That is obviously always in it. Next thing I have are my business cards. This one is my business cards for my blog consultation site. And these are my normal blogger um, business cards. I keep them separate so that I can make sure I know which ones I'm grabbing if someone asks for them. This is my handy dandy Joe jacket coffee sleeve that I keep in my purse all the time just in case. This is my Be Delectable from Cake Beauty Coconut and Cream Lotion, which I absolutely adore. It smells so yummy that I try to use it as little as possible just so I can keep, keep it for as long as possible. This is a Vera Bradley, like, um, it's supposed to be like a card pouch, but I actually use it for all my rewards cards. I seriously have a rewards card for every single store you can think of. So that's what that is. This is napkin, or not napkins these are kleenex tissues i just love the packaging of it so that's that um here are some <laughs> random pieces of candy and mints that i always seem to have floating around in my purse somewhere now we're gonna oh this is like a spare little wallet it's just i keep this for like to keep a stash of money to the side because yeah i never keep cash on me so i try to keep some and as you can see that was empty so i don't even have any right now this, my friends, isn't this cute? I had to get it because it was pink and it had glass on it. But this is actually where I keep my um, backup charger for my phone. It's a Lenovo, I think it's um, 6,000 MPH chow, um, chow, charger. So I keep that with me all times because if you know you're a blogger, you're a blogger, you always need to have backup power for your phones because it's just inevitable that it's going to die on you sooner or later. But now I'm going to get to the fun part of the video, which is also what's in my bag, but this is how I organize my bag. If you're a girl, well, you girls know. When you have purses, most times we switch them kind of often, depending on an outfit, occasion, whatever. You want to switch your bag, but you don't necessarily want to take out a bunch of individual stuff to switch bags because it can take forever. Nine out of ten, you'll forget something. It's a hassle. So the way I have learned or started organizing my bag is with ipsy bags ipsy bag is a monthly makeup subscription and you get a cool bag makeup bag every month i've been a part of ipsy now for a little bit over a year so that means i have over 12 bags after a while there's only so many makeup bags you can use at one time and then that's when i decided you know what i'm gonna put these things to use in another way so i started using them to organize my purse this was a Ipsy bag from I think about a month or two ago and it was actually like an envelope. This one I use to keep receipts and papers that I might need to hold on to and so that they don't get all crazy in my purse. That's why I use that. This Ipsy bag, I don't know what month it was, but this one actually has my hard drive, external hard drive for my blog and stuff in it. That's what I use that one for. This Ipsy bag, I actually use for pens and pencils and all that lovely stuff. This Ipsy bag is for like little personal stuff, spare deodorant, pills, girly stuff, all that. This Ipsy bag is actually like makeup, lippies, and all that lovely stuff. But do you see the trend here? All of these bags have everything I need in my purse, but in just four bags, I emptied my purse out. Which means, if I was ready to switch purses, I could just reach for the new purse, open it up, take a bag, drop it in. Take a bag, drop it in. See what I'm saying? And then you just organize the bags inside the bag. It's so easy and I absolutely love this way because I never have to worry about forgetting anything because I literally have everything compartmentalized. And if there happens to be an occasion where I know I'm not going to need, say, my hard drive or the power charger, which is rare, I just leave it out. It's that simple. So 
that's what's in my bag. The only thing left in this bag, now that I've switched out all my Ipsy bags, are my keys. And that's just easy because with my cords, you have this little handy dandy key fob. Ta-da. Ta-da. Bag switched ah. over. And then I just continue to put in the rest of my stuff. Handy dandy tissues, business cards, lotion, ah. rewards cards. Ah. These random pieces of candy are probably going to go in the front so I can get them quickly. And finally, my wallet. Which, once you adjust how you want your bags, is easy peasy, one, two, three. Easy. So that is not only what was in my bag, but how I organize and switch my bags using Ipsy Bags. How many times can you say bags? I don't know. I think I said it a bunch. But that's the end of this video. I'll see you next time. And I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Smooching.